Welcome to the Morning Swim Show for Friday, July 30th, 2010. I'm your host, Peter Bush. In the Phoenix Monitor today, we'll talk to Mike Bottom. It didn't take long for him to find the recruiting touch as the head coach of the Michigan Wolverines men's team. Coach Bottom joins us right now in the Phoenix Monitor from his office in Michigan. Coach, how you doing? Good, Peter. How are you doing? Good. Uh, we, we at uh, Swimming World TV thought you by far had the best incoming recruiting class, headlined by guys like Kyle Whitaker. You sure hit the hit it on the mark this past fall. Well, you know, you always you always say recruiting classes are not uh, judged until they're finished, right? So we'll see after the freshman year what what we have. Well, nonetheless, you're probably pretty excited to have these guys on deck soon. Yeah, we we um, we have a big team, and I think we're ready we're ready to take these guys in and make them Wolverines. How's the summer training going? We have about uh, 40 swimmers in the water, um, about almost 30 going to, to U.S. Nationals with uh, PANPAC trials. So we're excited about uh, you know, our training, and we're excited about what, what will happen. You know, everybody calls you a sprint coach, but Peter Vanderkay is having one heck of a year. He looks like he is going to do some serious damage next week in California. Well, Peter... Peter is a, is a wonderful individual. I mean, anybody that understands Peter knows his loyalty, knows he's a Michigan man through and through. Um, and I've always talked about my coaching style as I am, I am a, a coach that gets coached, and Peter is a great coach for his coach. Okay, I'm trying to keep all these coaches straight here. So who's the coach? <laughs> Peter's the coach. <laughs> so what do you do? Uh, you know, I just do this, looking good. Looking good. You're looking good. No, you're looking good, Coach. I think you have the best hair in college swimming. <laughs> Thanks, Peter. <laughs> Work hard at it. <laughs> hey, uh, how about w Wu Peng? He's training with you guys this summer. What, uh, he is. what is his talent like watching on a day to day basis? Well, Nathan, Na we call him Nathan. Uh, Nathan wait, is why, wait, 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 wait. Time out. Why do you call Wu Peng Nathan? That's his. That's his choice. That's his choice name. When we when he came in, we started calling him Pong and and uh, he uh, he said, "My name's Nathan." I said, "Okay, your name's Nathan." You know, it's it, that is the uh, the luxury of someone who comes into the English system, is they can name themselves whatever they want. Huh? Does that mean we get to name ourselves whatever we want if we go to China? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely, you can call yourself uh, whatever you want, and I'm not. I'm not even going to say any Chinese words because I only know a few, and I'm, they're not repeatable. Okay. Well, how's Nathan doing? He's doing well. He's. Uh, I think he came to us a little bit out of shape, but uh, uh, swimming next to Matt, uh, you know, Matt Patton and uh, Peter Vanderkay and Dan uh, Dan Madwood. He's he's doing real well. I think he's he's holding his own against those guys and. I think we could see we'll see some good swimming by him at uh, Pampax. Are you disappointed that Tyler didn't train with you for the summer? Actually, I would expect that Tyler would go home. Uh, it was a great opportunity for him. I mean, his home pool is is Fullerton. You know, Kevin Perry, what a great coach he was, and uh, what a great memory he's he's left in in Tyler. And I think that it's it's uh, an honor that that he can go back and swim at Fullerton for his home team. Hey, before we let you go, we've been noticing a pretty interesting digital marketing campaign that Club Wolverine seems to have right now on Facebook. Uh, I, whose idea was this, these funny little short videos? Well, I think um, our we have some postgraduates, and our postgraduates, are uh, they swim because they love to do what they do. Uh, and they're here at Club Wolverine because... Um, our environment gives them the freedom to express themselves in a lot of different ways. You know, we, we listen to them about workouts. We talk to them about techniques. Uh, we have a lot of opportunities for them to, to get better. And part of our push is a push in life for them. Um, and they're learning. They're learning different skills. Some of them are marketing. Some of them are, uh, you know, with, with, with video and, and splicing together video. Some of them are, are with web casting. Um, so they're taking the opportunity to learn, and as they do that, they're, they're having some fun doing it. It's been two years for you now at Michigan. Is this, uh, in your long coaching career, I mean, how are you right now in terms of happiness and fulfillment? 
I have a two-year-old and a three-year-old, and they're, uh, they're as happy as can be. And when I go home and get those big hugs, and I have this, know that I have this opportunity to, to come to work and have fun and then go home and get big hugs, uh, there's, there's no better life. Well, glad to hear you're doing well, Coach, and good luck next week in California. Thank you. That's Coach Mike Bottom joining us from Michigan. That's it for today's show. I'm Peter Bush reminding you to keep your head down at the finish.